Okay, so this is a little project that have been I have been thinking about. This is a fully working Toshiba um, laptop, obviously. Uh, it's not that old. I think I bought it back in 2009, I think. Yeah, 2009 I bought it. Um, it's a 13 inch and it's beautiful with those sparkle I don't know if you can see that yeah there we go sparkle blue black color there um, uh, what I'm about to do with this one or what I want to do with it it's that I want to uh, make it a, a Hackintosh yeah I want to make it a Hackintosh but I'm not really sure about how to do that so I'm asking you guys out there for some help. Um, oops, it's uh, as I said, not very old. Uh, its uh, model number is um, Toshiba U400. Yeah, U423F. That's what it is. Uh, the sticker there says it's an Intel. Pentium. I know the processor is uh, something called T4200 2.0 gigahertz. Um, that's what it is. And um, I haven't used this very much. It's in great shape, and I thought it would be a challenge to make it a Hackintosh. Hello, hello. So yeah, uh, that's what I've been thinking about. Um, something I don't like is that the, the touchpad here, uh, it's kind of very hard to know when you're actually on the touchpad and outside. Um, that's weird. Um, this one, this computer was very expensive when I bought it back in 2009. Um, it came with Vista, which I um, formatted and installed Windows 7. And now I want to make it a Hackintosh. Yeah, that's what I want to do. So if you guys know anything about how to make that happen, you could please write a comment in the box below. And this is exactly the serial numbers or, well, you don't need that, but uh, the model number over there, uh, PSU44E, and it's a satellite U423F. You can check up the specs on the internet. Uh, this one have uh, right now it's one uh, gigabyte of internal memory. The hard drive I think it's uh, 250, 250 gigabyte. Yeah, so. If you know anything about how to turn this one into a Hackintosh, please let me know in a comment in the box below here. And uh, uh, also, uh, I think it's only possible to have Snow Leopard on this one. Um, Mountain Lion, it's, I don't think, uh, the computer is too old, so Snow uh, Leopard is what it's going to be. So please let me know if you know anything about this. Yeah. Bye.